This program is part of the Baxter Training and Service Support Video Library. The tasks outlined here are to be performed only by Baxter authorized personnel. For clarification on any steps in this procedure, please refer to the Baxter Online Documentation Library or contact technical support as designated for your country or region. To complete this procedure, you will need the following. This video described the guidelines to update a Centrella bed to a new operating system using the customer tablet and Wi-Fi. Note, the bed and tablet must be on the same Wi-Fi network when updating to the new operating system. This cannot be performed with a patient on the bed and may take up to 30 minutes to complete. On the Centrella Smart Plus Bed Graphical Caregiver Interface, press the Settings menu controls. Press Bed Service. Enter the service code, press Enter. Navigate to the Wi-Fi menu and press that option. Press Add Profile. Use the keyboard to enter the profile name and press Enter. Note. The profile name does not have any specific requirements and can be anything you choose. Press scan and wait for the available networks to populate. Select your network from the list of available networks and then press select. The selected network details will auto-populate on the wireless config screen. If your network has a password, Press the pre-shared key button and use the keyboard to enter that information, then press enter. Press close. Press the profile you just created and then press activate. Press close. Press home. Verify that you have the Wi-Fi fan on the home screen. Connect the tablet to the same Wi-Fi network as the bed. The steps to perform this action may vary depending on the device manufacturer and model. Connect the Android service device to the bed using the included USB cables. USB cables are used to establish a secure connection between the bed and the Android device for the wireless transfer of the firmware package. You may get a pop-up that says Open Care Solution Service Tool to handle P7900. Select OK for this pop-up. If this is the first time using the app, you will get permission pop-ups. Select Accept on all pop-ups. From the Centrella Service Tool application landing page, press the Centrella icon. From the Centrella homepage, press the maintenance icon at the bottom of the screen. From the maintenance screen, press Firmware. Note, if this is the first time using the device, you will have to select the folder where the firmware files are stored. Press the Select Folder button at the top of the page. Press the Download folder. Press the BAS Files folder. At the bottom of the screen, press Use this folder. Press Allow on the Folder Access pop-up. From the Download Version drop-down, press the Centrella X.XX.000OS Upgrade BAS file. Note, the X's in the file name represent the version of firmware on the device. The actual numbers in the file name will vary depending on the version installed on the device. Press Install Download Version on Boards. Note, the service tool will do a compatibility check. This check looks at the version of firmware on the bed and the version attempting to be installed. If there are any compatibility mismatches, a pop-up screen will notify the user. If the bed and device are on the same network, the upgrade will start automatically. If they are not on the same network, you will get a notification stating as such. When the connection is successful, the files will begin to transfer to the bed.
When the File Transfer Complete pop-up appears, press OK. Note, once the files have been transferred, it takes the bed 20 minutes to process the upgrade. You can disconnect the USB cable from the bed and close the app at this time. Unlock the function controls at the side rail. After 20 minutes have elapsed, on the bed GCI, go to Settings, Bed Service, enter service code, press Software Update, press Upgrade. Note. You will see a screen showing the installation progress. Allow this to complete. On the Installation Complete screen, press Restart. The operating system takes up to 10 minutes to complete the installation. Press Close to complete the upgrade. For clarification on any steps in this procedure, Please refer to the instructions included with the service tool or contact technical support as designated for your country or region.